We've known for about a year now that Michael Fassbender is starring in and producing the upcoming video game adaptation Assassin's Creed and it appears we now have a director for the film. According to reports, Justin Curzel, who just finished directing Fassbender and Marianne Cotillard in the upcoming Shakespeare adaptation Macbeth, will helm the film. Schnepp, buy or sell Curzel directing Assassin's Creed? Well, I'm going to buy it. It's hard for me to buy it because I haven't seen Macbeth yet, but I did see his previous <gasps> film. It's called Moontown Murders. Right. Snow Super Town. disturbing. Oh. Uh, not Moontown, Snow Town. Snow Town. Sn yeah, what, Snow Snow Town? Town. Right. Yeah. Well, my movie's called Moontown Murders. <laughs> <laughs> it's like on the moon. Is, anyway, it's, it's moon. very uh, creepy. It reminded yeah. me a little bit of Animal Kingdom, too. Yeah, like, both of those guys have this disturbo way of like showing suburbia and all the creepy stuff that happens inside those homes that you drive by. So... Uh, I'm sure Macbeth is going to be great. I'm really excited about that adaptation with Fassbender and, and uh, Cotard is playing it with her French accent. So I'm really excited to see that. So I think he's an up-and-coming director. Hard to be, be like a super buy on it, but why not? I think if Fassbender, who's producing the game movie mm -hmm. version, uh, felt so great working with him, and he's like, yo, I want to keep working with you, come on with me to... Uh, you know, Assassin's Creed land. Yeah, so. I, I got to buy this one actually pretty seriously because if you've got the chops that you can pull off directing a Shakespearean film mm -hmm. and make it work and do it in such a way, and you know, we've talked about this before that one of the most important elements for a film to work is that dynamic between the actor and the director. Mm -hmm. And if Fassbender worked with this guy on a Shakespearean production and thought, this guy's good enough, I want to bring him over to Assassin's Creed, I haven't seen a lot of his work. None of us have. Mm. But that's got to be a good sign. So yeah. for me, it's a buy, mm -hmm. Alicia. Yeah, well, it's a huge buy for me. He's an Australian director, so I've been following his work for years. Yay. Snowtown is so creepy. It's on Netflix. If you haven't seen it, definitely recommend watching it. And if you see that movie, you see how well he uh, does character studies. So Macbeth is going to be fascinating. Mm. And then Assassin's Creed, I don't play video games, but I think it'll add a whole other layer of character depth on top of the video game action. Him and Fassbender together, I think such a great team. And we need uh, more character development, I think, in these video game films, because mm -hmm. there hasn't really been a good one yet. Right. No. Yeah, to your Mary? point, video game movies tend to not be good. Let's face it. I mean, there's not many great video game adaptations where you're like, wow, this is going to go down in history as one of the greatest oh, movies Oh, no, they ever. all suck. They all suck. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much all suck. I was being a nice Canadian, yeah. European, <laughs> but, but really, I, I agree. And I think, I think when you attract cast like Fassbender and like Cotillard, like when you bring people like that to your table as a director, it can only say good things about you as a director. It means they want to work with him and they're confident yeah. in his abilities. And now that he's doing this film, I'm, I'm buying this. Hey everyone, if you like this video, click that thumbs up button and make sure to subscribe to our AMC Movie News YouTube channel. It's free and helps you stay up to date with all the latest movie news, as well as our daily AMC Movie Talk Show. Also, make sure that you follow us on Facebook and Twitter to stay up to date with all of our special promotions, contests, and prize giveaways.